All right, listen to this. This guy's entering into the trades. He's concerned about, is he going to be big enough and strong enough? Check it out. Carpentry apprenticeship. Okay, I'm going to be honest. I'm not a big dude. Five foot eight inches and I weigh 140 pounds. My friend gave me a funny look when I told him I was... I would be going into carpentry and asked if I was sure about it, saying, it's a very physical job. Yeah, it is. Every time I see someone in construction around town, they always swole, and I'm worried I won't be able to keep up when I start my apprenticeship. I start next week. Kind of got pressured by my dad, but I'm genuinely interested in carpentry, and I want to pursue it as a job. I'm just worried about embarrassing myself by not being able to keep up with the physical side. I'm a runner, and I used to do cross country, so I know I will have the stamina, but I don't know if I'll have the strength. Okay, <laughs> first of all, let me tell you something you got going in your favor. The fact that you care, the fact that you care to want to be able to do a good job and keep up is a big deal. But let me put something in perspective for you. That's Lee Priest. Five-time champion, well, more than that, but this is Lee Priest next to Ronnie Coleman. You know, Mr. Mr. Olympia eight times. Lee Priest beat him five times in one year. Oh, by the way, like I said, Lee Priest is five foot four. Five foot four. He didn't let his size stop him. So unless you're thinking about going to the adult film industry, size doesn't really matter. Stay up with your running. If you're not doing it now, keep staying in shape. It's a big deal. The, the muscle will come, dude. The strength will come. And I'll tell you another thing you have going for you. The fact that you're only 140, you don't have all this extra weight to carry around. I weigh 220. It probably is what is responsible for wearing my ass out every day. Stay in shape. Eat right. Avoid cigarettes. Avoid alcohol. Other extra curricular activities, you know what I'm saying? Avoid those things. Treat your body right. Try to avoid even coffee and caffeine laden products because I'm just telling you right now, they dehydrate you. Hydration is the key. You're gonna do fine. Even when you look in in the military, some of the some of the toughest SOBs on this planet were the little guys. So you go out there, you do your job, hustle. That's the biggest thing. Hustle, pay attention to learn, and nobody's going to get worked up if there's a day that you can't lift some extraordinary thing. That's what tools are for. That's what equipment is for. You'll get the job done. Don't worry about it. Good luck with your apprenticeship.